Sometimes we can begin to take life a little too seriously, so today I decided to head out to the park and just have a great time with my friend Austin. And this video is a little different than usual, but I hope you enjoy it anyway. Alright, what's up, home slice bread slice dude slice slice slice? It's, it's your boy, me and him, and uh, I'm gonna shoot that ball out of the air with this arrow. Oh! Right. Yep. Let's do it. Uh, we'll get there. Are you having trouble with pickup lines? What's this is stretch place your arm around so lame so boring nah your girl likes archery oh. <laughs> i don't know where to put that but that's going in cringe they've never shot a bow in their life does this situation look similar familiar to you that's what i thought call me your resident guy who shoots balls out of the air don't take it out of context <laughs> I can't. We're told you that playing an archer class in an RPG game is lame. Well, guess what? They're right, but not today. Notice how we applied Newton's something law of gravity. Both objects hit the ground at the same time. They were not released at the same time. However, we can now find out the potential gravitational energy of that arrow determining at what point after the ball was kicked that I released the arrow, the height that the ball achieved, and the draw of the arrow, and the draw weight of the bow. We could determine that I missed the shot. Ever heard that you miss 100% of the shots you don't take? Well, I'm here to tell you that that's not true. You could still miss even if you try. Notice how the arrow didn't have enough distance to reach the ball. This is because uh, we're actually on Mars. Welcome to the future, everybody. We terraformed it. Alrighty, anyways, uh, where'd the arrow go? There it is. See in the next failed clip. Uh, the sky is blue and there aren't any clouds. The wind level is about not point. I don't care. I'm gonna shoot this ball out of the air. You can't stop me. I got a boat and arrow and I'm gonna shoot this ball in the ball and it's gonna hit the ball and fall into the ground because I'm so cool. Yeah. I may have hit it if you went a little bit to the side. Yeah. All right, do you like Minecraft? Do you like archery? Well, you're not gonna like this. Told you you wouldn't like it. Oh, safety properly. Don't do this. See, you do this, you won't do good. It's not a good way to shoot a bow. Yikes. That was actually kind of close. We hit it! Oh, oh my gosh! Oh my gosh, it's insane! Look at it! It's totally in the- Oh wait. Huh. Don't worry about that. <laughs> yeah, arrow didn't work so well. I played baseball for 12 years. Some of those years I pitched. Um, only fastball guy, because I'm very boring and basic. So let's figure out and see what goes on. Well, it was more straight. Oh, that was so close. That would have been so cool too, because you'd really hear it. Potential kinetic energy. I don't know if your physics has ever taught you very well what it means. Well, essentially what it's telling you is that this ball, moving at 50 miles an hour, will clobber your face and break your nose. Let's pretend this soccer ball is your face. Find out what happens. <laughs> Getting my baseball red stamp. You gotta stay loose and limber. Oh. Let's go! Oh. oh my god! You got it! That <laughs> oh, was way more exciting than I thought it was gonna be. Taking some time off to relax can be a great way to de-stress and have a great time. So what are you waiting for? Hang out now and regret never!